All right, guys, Coach Dan here with Straight School. I am joined today with Coach Eliza. We're going to be going over the offset single arm dumbbell bench press. A um, couple reasons why we love this move, especially for our overhead athletes. One, the range of motion that we are going to be able to get through the scap of not being locked down um, by our bench. By doing this offset or single arm, we also add in a little variability of using trunk stability. Um, and lastly, the, and most importantly, especially again with our overhead athletes, is that this requires a lot of uh, strength balance. Um, so we'll expose any imbalances that we have between right and left. Now as Coach Elijah goes through this movement, I really want you to pay attention um, through that upper back and notice that he's pulling. As we get confused with a pressing motion that we're actually pressing. And the reality is, is through our body mechanics, we can only pull, right? So as we lower this uh, dumbbell down, Elijah is actually actively pulling this down, which is what this offset um, kind of exposes and allows him to do. From there, squeezing through that chest, having that chest pull as he presses up. Um, last thing, big thing here is, one thing that we always recommend is start with your weaker arm of the two and use that, especially if you're working with um, trying to get this to even out or correct any imbalances that you guys might have. Last thing with this offset dumbbell single arm bench press, is that the, the importance of your offset arm or, or your non-working arm needs to be in a position, whether it's Elijah across his chest or if you're going straight up to your side or up, it just needs to be in a position that allows you to maintain proper tension through that upper back.